All right then. My plan for today is to spend the entire day setting up pranks for Mikey. Will he realize he's being pranked in the end? On that note, this is Mikey's house. I wonder if he's home. <gasps> Mikey's asleep right now. I should set up a prank at the front of Mikey's house while I have a chance. I'll set up a trap right by this entrance. First, I grab a carved pumpkin. Then, I'll grab an enchanted book with the curse of binding, an anvil, an observer, and a dispenser. Now, I'll set my trap up beneath the entrance. I hope the noise doesn't wake Mikey up and give me away. First up, I'll put a curse of binding on the carved pumpkin. Now I have a carved pumpkin that can't be removed once worn. Now for the next step, I'll set up an observer beneath the door. The door goes above it. <laughs> Am I safe? The observer will react when the door is opened. Now I'll put a dispenser here, and then inside... I'll insert the carved pumpkin. Then I'll place redstone dust beneath it. Now to fill this in... Finished! When this door is open, Mikey will be automatically equipped with the carved pumpkin that he won't be able to remove. He won't be able to see much with that carved pumpkin on, and he won't even be able to see the ground, which is why... I'll set a pitfall trap up next. Mikey is sure to fall for the trap when he can't see. I think I'll use a command to make a pit right around here. Oh, that's an enormous pit! My prep work is now complete. I'll make myself invisible while I wait for Mikey to wake up. <sighs> I slept really well. It looks like Mikey woke up. Will he realize I've set up a prank? I think I'll go get some sunlight to wake myself up. Huh? What happened? Oh, he fell for it! <gasps> what is this? What do I do? <gasps> I can barely see anything! But this isn't so bad, so I guess I'll go work on the farm! that it's a prank? Oh! I must still be dreaming! <laughs> I guess I'll let myself sleep a little more. Hmm. Good idea. Good night, me. Mikey doesn't have a clue that I pranked him. I guess I should check up on Mikey. How's he doing? He's still asleep? Oh, he woke up! Huh? I thought that was a dream! Huh, how strange! Hmm. Whatever! I should probably get out of this hole! I'll stack blocks to escape! Oh, Mikey's climbing out! I'd better move! I'll watch how he's doing from a distance! on his way to work on the farm, so I think I'll race ahead and set up a trap for him there. I went ahead and now I'm at Mikey's farm. It's pretty big. I want to set up a trap before he gets here. Oh, he even has a chest with lots of seeds inside. Huh? There are a few places around here where Mikey hasn't tilled the soil yet. I'd like to use these to set a good trap. Right. I know what to make. If the soil gets tilled, let's have it activate the trap that I have in mind. I'm gonna dig here. And I'll set an observer under here. I'll set something else up over here. Let's dig everything out around here. Oh. 
Okay, I've now made a wide open space underneath Mikey's farm. Here, right beneath Mikey's farm, I'll completely fill this space full of TNT. Finished. Now, if someone tills the soil here, it'll send a signal down to the TNT I've stuffed down below, and it'll set off a huge explosion. To give Mikey a chance, I'll place a sign that says, Do Not Plow. Now to go invisible and wait for Mikey to show up. Oh, Mikey's made it to the farm. <laughs> Another day of hard work. I'll grow lots of food, harvest lots of crops, and eat until my belly is full. All right. my farm? Do not plow! Danger! What does that mean? How could my farm be dangerous? There's nothing wrong with my farm! Oh, I need to plow that soil over there! There should be a hole inside of my chest! Okay, I'll plow here! And then I think I'll plant some wheat! A little of this! Alright! Oh, here too! Growing so much food, I can't wait to harvest it. Let's plow this too. Just like this. Huh? I need to plow over there too. Okay, here too. Next up. Oh, what? What's going on? Ouch! Oh! Something caused a massive explosion. How is that possible? No way! Could it have been? No, oh, no. Mikey must have figured me out this time. My farm was struck by lightning! Ah! I guess I should be grateful that I was struck by lightning and survived! <laughs> Mikey still doesn't have a clue that I've been pranking him! I've been digging so much, but I can't seem to find diamonds anywhere. It looks like Mikey is searching for diamonds, so I think I'll set a trap where he can't see it. I think I'll make it over here where there's a large ravine. I see water down there. I'll place a huge vein of diamond ore here to lure Mikey over. And I'll put lava over here. What's this? A hostage situation? If you want the hostage returned, prepare to give me one million dollars. Otherwise, I'll blow myself up along with the hostage. Save me! This guy's crazy! Just do what he says! Ugh. That was Mikey! That must mean the hostage situation. Is it Mikey's house? Oh man, this is terrible! A hostage situation in my own village? And Mikey is the hostage? Huh. This is unreal. Besides, I don't have a million dollars. Are those... Explosives on Mikey's house? What? No way I'm getting past the police barricade. Sheesh! This leaves me no choice but to save Mikey on my own. Hmm. If I'm not careful, the criminal will press the detonator and Mikey will be toast. First things first, I need to know what's going on in there before I can make my plan. Let's see. I'm gonna need my computer for this one. Let's get it set up. All right then. I'm going to try and hack the security cameras in Mikey's house. I'm in. Now I should have access to his camera feed. Please, why are you doing this? <laughs> hey, stop that! That hurts! Oh, 
it's worse than I thought. Mikey's being tormented in there. I need to act fast. Huh. Let's see. Here's what I know for sure. The criminal is acting alone. So, if I can take him out with a sniper rifle, then problem solved. Okay, I just need to sneak up. Oh, there's a window. I'll use it to line up the shot. I can't let the criminal see me out here. Let's get set up among the trees, nice and stealthy, and find the perfect position. Okay, I think this is my best bet. Yeah. There he is. I can covertly take out the criminal from here. Carefully... Line up the shot. Okay, he's in my sights. I can do this. I just have to... Huh? No, Mikey, get out of the way! That was way too close. Come on, buddy. Move just a bit more. Okay, here we go. Yeah! Hold on. This time for sure. Please don't get in the way again. There. I've got you this time. Three, two, one. Mikey! Ugh! This is really stressful. Mikey is moving around way too much. I don't know which one of them I'd hit. It's way too risky. Ugh! I need to find another way to save him. What else can I try? Hmm. Hey, that could work. Okay, I have a much safer idea now. What if I was able to disarm all of those explosives? Then he wouldn't be able to self-destruct, and the police could safely charge in. I'm gonna need my laptop for this. If I can get the computer close enough to the house, I may be able to hack into the explosives and disarm them. But, to get that close without being seen, a camouflage suit would come in handy. A set of leather armor and some green dye should do the trick. There, that's a full suit. Let's see how the camouflage looks. Mmm, not bad. Now, I can lie down and blend in seamlessly with the grass. See? I'm basically invisible. Let's give this a try. First, I have to sneak past the police. Alright. The green dye matches the grass nicely, so I'm well hidden. Even if he looks outside, I doubt he'll even see me. I need to get really close to hack the explosives. Just a little closer. Yikes! Duh! I didn't think he'd come outside. It seems he hasn't noticed me. Still, I won't move when he looks my way. Just a bit closer. Oh, he's so close! I'm almost within hacking range. Yeah, I'm still hidden. This is so tense, but I think it'll work. Come on. No, no, I've been seen. Abort! He's shooting at me. I have to get out of here. Get to cover. Tactical retreat. Sheesh. Aww. No? What's going on now? The criminal is on top of the house. My demands are clear. One million dollars within five minutes. Or boom! Huh? Did I just hear that right? I have five minutes to save Mikey, or he'll be caught in the explosion along with the criminal? What? Well, what am I gonna do? Oh, huh? I got it! An idea just came to me! We're gonna try a new approach. Check this out. It's a drill. I can use this drill to dig a tunnel all the way to Mikey's house and get him out of there before it's too late. The criminal won't notice it from the roof. It's genius! I'll start behind the house. Alright, let's use this drill to save Mikey. Yeah. Now we're getting somewhere. Man, this thing is heavy. Yeah. There. Now to leave a ladder so I can get back out. Perfect. At this depth, I should be able to dig my way over without getting the criminal's attention. Hold tight, Mikey. I'm coming for you. I think it's this way. Go! That's not good. Now what do I do? I managed to dig straight into a lava pool. This wasn't in my plan. 
I guess I'll block it off and try digging around it. We'll just make a slight detour. Hmm. I think that should be far enough. Good. Now let's get back on course. Next stop, Mikey's house. I'm pretty sure this is the right spot. There's not much time, so let's check the surface. Going up. I'll just make a pillar with cobblestone. That's good enough. There. Is that? That's the house, all right. But I'm not quite in the right spot. Uh, I guess I drilled a little too far. Clock's ticking! Yikes! There's the criminal. You had two minutes to provide the money! This is bad. He's gonna see me. What do I do? Ugh, I gotta hide. Back into the tunnel. That was way too close. I can't believe it. He almost saw me. That would have been bad. Well, I guess the tunnel should be actually in this area? Okay, I've got some big news. Today, I acquired the power to turn into a ghost. Whew, I told you. Cool, huh? Check it out. I'm totally see-through. Now, here's the plan. I'm gonna use my new ability to give Mikey a scare or two. When I transform into a ghost, Mikey won't be able to see or hear me. Still, I wonder, will Mikey really not notice me? All right, I'm still in human mode. This is where Mikey lives. I'm gonna knock on his door and call out for him. Hey, Mikey, it's me, JJ. Come outside and hang out. Okay, that's enough. Ghost mode activated. Now he can't see me. How's he gonna react? <gasps> that's weird. I could have sworn I heard JJ. Is he hiding? I bet he is. But where? Is he gonna figure it out? Aww. Maybe he can sense me. Where is he? <laughs> nope. He really can't see me or even hear me when I'm in ghost mode. He doesn't have a clue. I knocked on his door, but... Aww. That just confused him. Did I imagine JJ's voice? Maybe. Whatever. I'm gonna go over to his house. He's going where? Okay. Well, I guess I'll follow him. In ghost mode, of course. We're here. But what does he want to do? Hey, JJ! Come out and play! Hello? JJ? Can you hear me? Ah. Oh, Mikey wants to hang out. But I'm already here as a ghost, so I can't answer the door. What's he gonna do? Hello? Maybe you'll just go home. JJ! Come on! What do we do? <gasps> Wait a second! Hmm? I know! Yes! Of course! That's it! JJ must be sound asleep! That's why he's not answering. It's up to me to wake him up! I'm going in! <laughs> he let himself in because he thinks I'm snoozing? Hmm. He's not home after all. I am, actually. Where could he have gone? Hmm. <laughs> I'm right here, buddy. You just can't see me. Huh. What's Mikey gonna do now? Go looking for me? Huh? Huh? Cake! Yummy cake! Oh, I thought he caught me for a second there. But he just spotted my cake. He wouldn't eat it without my permission, would he? I mean, it's mine. I love cake! This one's JJ's. It wouldn't be right for me to eat it. Hmm. But if I only took one bite, he wouldn't notice, right? What? How would he know? I mean, he'd know I could be seen. He would never find out. I would, actually. Is he really gonna do it? Hmm? Hmm. He's making sure I'm not around. Okay, I think the coast is clear. One bite. Mm -hmm. That's the stuff. Oh. Another one. <gasps> it's so good. No, my cake. There are two whole slices missing from it. One last tiny bite. Mm. You'll never know. Wow. 
<laughs> Half of it is gone. Delish! He actually ate my cake! He doesn't know what he's missing! Is he back yet? Oh, I've been here the whole time. I want to give Mikey a scoop. While he's looking for me, I'm gonna transform. Ghost mode, off! There! Back to normal. He should be able to see me now. Mikey? Uh... Mikey! One more couldn't hurt! <gasps> oh! Gigi! Hey! Hi! Howdy! How do you do? Hi! Do -do -do. What are you doing here? Me? Oh! Uh, nothing at all! Just visiting! You ate my cake, didn't you, Mikey? Huh? Well, maybe a little bit of it, but... but uh, I'm sorry... It's okay. Since you apologized, I'll let you have the rest of it. <gasps> really? Oh, thanks! Cake is my favorite! Nom, nom, nom. Now that was funny. I think I'm gonna keep using my ghost powers on Mikey. Surprising him is so fun! Whoa! It's gotten late! Today just flew by! Check out the rain! Hmm? Huh? What's that sound? Uh... Oh, Mikey! It's a breaking news alert! Let's turn on the TV and see what's going on. <gasps> Apparently, there's been a string of robberies nearby, and the thief is super dangerous. <gasps> Duh. Robberies, huh? I hope it's okay. Uh, I gotta go home. There's something I forgot to do. Bye! Hmm? Thanks for having me! Aw, not the rain! Wait, Mikey, what's wrong? You left in such a hurry, I wonder what the matter is. I should switch to ghost mode and tail him in secret. There! Now I can find out why he left in such a big rush without raising suspicion. Hmm. I hope it's safe! Huh, what's he so worked up about? I have to know. Gotta hurry! Why are you so stressed out, buddy? Hmm? Hello? Who's he looking for? All clear. This is so curious. Okay, doesn't seem like anyone's looking. Just think there's a thief on the loose. I have to make sure it's safe. Hmm? Oh. No, what? Mikey has a secret passage? I've got to see what's down there. Oh. Huh? All right. Nobody's around. Time to go. Into my super secret hideout. I doubt a thief would make it this far. But still, I have to check. Phew. I was sure that splash would give me away. I can't believe Mikey has a secret hideout. He never told me. I'm totally stunned. Oh. Good. I'm not being followed. You. Still in the clear. This passage is so long, and he doesn't have a clue that I'm tailing him. All thanks to Ghost Mode. Huh? I'm here, and I'm the only person in the world who can get through my security system. What is this place? That burglar doesn't stand a chance. Oh, how is he gonna get across the lava? I hope it's safe. Huh? Whoa! <laughs> I never would have guessed Mikey had this in his basement. Uh, a chest. Wonder what's inside it. What are you trying to keep safe, Mikey? Hmm. I think the coast is clear. Here goes. Oh, good. Hmm? <sighs> it's still here. My precious diamond. I'm so happy it didn't get stolen! This is terrible! Oh, Mikey! I heard you were in an accident! Are you okay? Uh, Here, an apple a day? Oh! And flowers. Uh, I tripped and hurt myself! I can't walk! <laughs> Weird, huh? What? You can't walk, really? Yeah, but I'll be fine after surgery. That'll fix me up. Uh, Mikey, the thing is... Huh? Surgery is expensive. Oh? The cost is... Three million dollars. Huh? No way! I don't have 
have that money? What am I gonna do? Hmm. Oh, wait! I have an idea! Really? Mm-hmm! You do? Mm hmm What is it? What are you doing on the computer? Well... Hmm? Have you ever heard of crowdfunding? What's that? It's when you collect donations online! That's how I'll get the money! You're gonna use crowdfunding for that? It's that easy? It's easy to raise money like this! I'll just mess around on my phone while I wait! <sighs> Mikey! Oh! I'm here to visit you! Aw, oh, thanks! I love having my phone! Oh, hey! How is your crowdfunding? Great! I should check! Do I have three million yet? Let's see! Well? Hmm... Oh! Huh? What? No! What? Oh! How much? That's weird! I didn't even raise a penny! Seriously? I'm doomed! Three million dollars is impossible! Oh. You didn't raise any money? You can't give up! Huh? You have to walk again, Mikey! I'll look for a part-time job! I'll work for you! Thank you! All right, mining is the highest paying job around, so that's what I'll do. Hmm, rare ores. Oh, there's one. I'll mine as many as I can. If I find enough of these, I'll get a bonus. All right. Rare ores are more common the deeper you go. Whoa! <laughs> oh. No way! It's a diamond ore! Whoa! Oh, that's great! Nice! I've already found diamonds and iron! I think I'll try going even deeper down. There might be more rare ores down there. I'll just have to be careful not to fall into the lava. Ah. Hmm. Ah. Huh. Let's see. Wonder if there's something around here. Wow. Looks like no one is mined beyond this point. They handed out dynamite, so I'll lay out a good amount of TNT. A really good amount. And then... Light it! Run away, run away, run away! Whoa! Now, any rare ores down... there? What? Huh? What? Really? Emeralds and diamonds! There's even a lot of gold! Whoa! This is amazing! Look! There's even some coal, too! This is unbelievable! <laughs> yes! It was pure luck! But I found so much! Look how much I found here! I'm gonna get a crazy huge bonus! This job is so easy! Wow! Alright! Well then, let's get started! All right then, I worked hard at my part-time job for one whole week. It was tough, it was difficult, but I searched and found plenty of rare ores. It's time to collect my pay. Okay, oh, that's the place. I should be able to get paid there. <clears throat> Hello, I would like my pay for the week, please. In cash. He's counting it all up. I bet it's gonna be a lot. I found so much! I'm so excited! Oh, looks like he's grabbing the money. How much did I make? Come on, come on! Huh? You're done? Huh? That's all? Seriously? You're joking! I worked hard for an entire week in the mines and all I got was a measly hundred dollars? What? How? How is that possible? At this rate, I'll never be able to make three million dollars. Hmm... Oh, I have an idea. 
There's a way to help Mikey get his surgery without spending the money. Let's go. Mikey. Huh? Hey, I'm sorry, but I couldn't make enough money. Oh, no! But I thought of a way for you to get your surgery. Wait, are you serious? Yes, if I become a doctor and do your surgery. What? You're gonna become a doctor? Are you sure you can do it? That's extremely difficult. I'm still gonna try. <sighs> oh, wow! Starting today, I'm a student. I need to pass my medical exam and get my license. Then, I can do the surgery for Mikey. I'm gonna work super hard. Okay, where's my first class? Hmm. Oh, I see. This is an ultrasound. I need to be able to understand scans like these. Hmm. Hmm. Ah, what do we have here? Hmm. This is where I learned to do surgery. Huh. Oh, so that's how you sedate a patient. Cool. And these are the tools. All right. Huh. This here monitors the vitals. Fascinating. Okay, okay. Now, I just have to study. I need to memorize every single one of these books to pass the test. It looks difficult, but still, I'll do my best. I'm gonna study absolutely everything. Mikey, I'm here now. Huh? Huh? JJ, are you my... I have some good news. I am now your doctor. Wow, you really did it. Nice. Yeah. Well, Mikey, it's time for me to do your surgery. Woohoo! Let's do this! long was I out? And where am I? This looks like a train. And the other passengers, they're asleep too. Huh. Oh, Mikey's here too. Hey, Mikey. Wait, what was that noise? Huh? Someone just entered the train car. Am I crazy? Or is there a monkey on the train? Killed a villager! This is bad! He's coming this way! We need to get out of here! And fast! Come on, Mikey! Wake up! <laughs> He's not waking up! What do I do? I don't have much time! I may have to wake him up by force! Mikey! Come on! You have to wake up! Ah! Hey! What was that for? Ugh! You're so mean, JJ! I was having such a nice dream! Now's not the time, Mikey! We have to get out of here! What are you talking about? Look! What is that thing? Let's get out of here! Now! Alright! Hurry! Run away! <gasps> uh, oh no! The door is sealed off with iron bars! There's nowhere to run! Seriously? What are we gonna do? Uh, uh, oh! There's a chest! Maybe this'll help us. Oh! It's just some loaves of bread! It's no good, Mikey. There was nothing useful in there at all! Uh, uh -oh. We're out of time! What? Uh, the monkey's caught up! It's all over for us! We can't give up! <laughs> Come on, think! Uh, wait, what? We're back in our home. This must have been a dream, but it felt so real. <sighs> oh no, stop it! 
Sounds like Mikey's having a nightmare. I'll wake him up. Uh, go away! Mikey, wake up! Are you okay? Huh? Huh? It was only a dream? Are you alright, Mikey? That sounded like a really bad dream. Oh, JJ! In my dream, we were on a train being attacked by a monkey! It was right about to get us! I'm glad that wasn't real! A dream where a monkey was attacking us? Are you sure? Yeah? Why? Well, I had the exact same dream! Huh? No way! You're joking! Oh no, I have a bad feeling about this. Huh? What are you talking about? Hold on, let me check something. Is this the monkey you saw? Yeah! That's exactly what I saw! Oh no, he's called the Circus Monkey. And if he finds you, he can kill you in your dreams. It looks like we've become his next targets. So we're being hunted by an evil monkey? What can we do about it? Well, one thing we could do is never sleep again. If we never sleep, we'll never dream. So he won't be able to attack us. Yeah, that could work. <laughs> Wait, but I like sleeping. That's not gonna happen. Yeah, it's not a very good plan. Our other option is to beat the circus monkey in our dreams. Okay, it sounds like we can do that. Let's take the circus monkey down. I'd love to, but it won't be easy. How are we supposed to bring weapons into our dreams? All right. We could never beat him with our bare hands. Hmm, there must be a way. What do we do? Hey, what if... Yeah? This chest. I'm sure I saw it on the train. Huh? No way. These loaves of bread were in the dream, too. Really? Maybe, just maybe, this chest will let us bring items into our dreams. You really think so? Then all we have to do is put weapons in there and the circus monkey is toast! Alright, let's gather the items we'll need. Okay, let's do it! Preparations complete. We'll set up a security system inside the dream train. So, what are we bringing with us? This is everything we've managed to gather. Ooh! We have some redstone components, two sets of netherite gear, and two energy launchers. Awesome! Alright, let's get the bread out of the way and fill up this chest with our new awesome equipment. This is great! The circus monkey isn't gonna stand a chance! That's right, we have more than enough. Our preparations are complete. Let's get some sleep. I'll see you back on the dream train. Yeah, let's take him down. Good night. Yeah. <laughs> oh, JJ. Hey. Hi. We're back. Hmm. The circus monkey will probably show up really soon. You're right. Let's hurry and set up our security system. You got it, Mikey. Well, let's take a look inside the chest. Hmm. Open up. Yes. All of our stuff is here. This is great news. Now, let's gather it all up. We should act fast, since we don't know how much time we have. Okay, let's get to work. What should we build? Well, for starters, the circus monkey will attack from this side. So our first security measure will be to put a trap by the door. Okay, what kind of trap will we use? Well, I'll start by setting up a couple of tripwire hooks. I see! And then the tripwire itself. There! When he steps on this, it will activate the rest of the trap. That's what I'll build next. What will that be? Next, I'll set up some blocks on the walls. Okay. Then, I'll arrange these redstone torches and pistons. Hmm? Huh? The pistons go up here. Uh-huh. Now to wire them up with redstone dust, like so. Interesting! And finally, on top of the pistons, four heavy anvils. Oh! So when the circus monkey steps on the tripwire, wow! he gets flattened like a pancake. 
It's the perfect trap. Wow, this is awesome. I can't wait to see it in action. He doesn't stand a chance. Next, I'll set up a lava trap. Good idea. Right here. First, I'll dig out a pit. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Just in case the anvils aren't enough. That looks deep enough. Nice. There. And now let's cover it up. What's that? It looks like the carpet at a glance. But it will break if something heavy steps on it. Hopefully, it'll trick him. Oh, clever. Thanks. I hope it works. There. If the monkey makes it to this green floor, it'll fall into the lava. That's perfect. Not even the circus monkey can avoid that. This is probably enough security, right? Maybe, but just in case, let's build an arrow trap. <laughs> let's start by clearing some of the carpet to make room for these pressure plates. There. <laughs> Next, we'll need some dispensers. Next up, there's another mechanism I want to build here. Really? What's that? Like this. And now to cover it up. Oh, so now it's all connected. That's right. And it's totally hidden. Great. And of course, we have to fill the dispensers with stacks of arrows. Of course. Finally, I'll hook this up with redstone dust. All right, it's finished. When he steps on these pressure plates, it will fire a barrage of arrows. I'll demonstrate. Whoa! <laughs> That's awesome! Oh yeah, this will definitely do the trick. The circus monkey is going down. We have so much security, this will be easy. Remember though, Mikey, just in case he makes it past our security, we'll have to fight him directly. I guess. But still, there's no way it'll come to that. Maybe, but just to be safe, I brought us these sets of netherite equipment. So let's put them on, okay? All right. Good. Let's also keep these golden apples in case we need a power-up. Whoa, thanks, JJ. Yeah, let's suit up. Let's do it. Looking good. All right. Hey, JJ, did you bring the energy launchers? Let's use those. They're awesome. That's true, but if we use them inside the train, we'll get caught up in the blast, so we should only use them as a last resort. Okay, Mikey? Oh, I see. Let's put them away. That's a shame, but I guess it's for the best. Yeah, all that's left to do now is wait. That monkey doesn't know what's coming. Listen. Huh? The door just unlocked. Get ready, Mikey. The circus monkey is coming. I'm ready. No! He's here! There he is! <sighs> it's the circus monkey! We'll be okay. We've got traps ready. Yeah! That's right. Okay. Let's show this monkey what we've got. <laughs> Come on. Just a little closer. He's about to set it off. We got him! <laughs> Take that! Huh? What? No! Uh, he set off the trap, but it barely hurt him at all! How? He's still coming towards us! Get back! Retreat! Uh, uh. We're still okay! We still have the lava trap! That'll finish him off! Right! Take this! Yes! Uh, it worked! We uh, fell into the lava! Uh, huh? Uh-oh. What? Is he climbing back out? He's still coming! We have to retreat again! Go, Mikey! Look for it! Come on! Please! Alright! This one has to work! It has to! The arrow trap should finish him off! Yes! Good! He activated the trap! It's working! Come on! This is it, right? He's gotta be low on health now! What? Look out, Mikey! Huh? You're kidding me! Impossible! He made it through the arrow trap! What now? This is bad! He's got us cornered! What do we do? Well, our only choice is to fight him ourselves. Eat your golden apple and attack! Okay, got it! Let's deal with that circus monkey! He's going down! 
Your reign of terror ends here! He's really strong! Come on! Are you okay, Mikey? I think so! This guy hits like a truck! Keep attacking! Don't let up! No, it's longer now! <laughs> yes! We did it! Great job! Now we don't have to live in fear of the circus monkey anymore! What a relief! Aw, oh, Mikey, something terrible has happened. Hmm? It's awful. Do you see that? See what? That guy over there. What guy? Over there. Him. Who is it? Don't get close. I feel like I should know this. What is it again? Oh, wait. I know. Mikey, take this seriously. Why? How can it be dangerous if it doesn't move? Well, we're fine right now because one of us is watching him. But the moment we look away, he'll attack us! Oh! I think I've heard of this! So we just have to keep our eyes on him? That's right. Or he'll come after us. Let's put some distance between us, back up, but keep watching him. This feels a little extra. I'm serious. He'll attack. But JJ, I need to see it to believe it. If I don't... Will he really attack? I want to look away. Aren't you curious? We're far enough away now that I think we can test it, Mikey. I'm gonna look away, so keep your eyes on him. Okay! I'm watching! I'm gonna look away, and then press F5. Ready? You can look away now, but look back quickly. It'll be fine. Woo. Ah! Ah! What's that scary noise he makes? I need to look. This guy really might be bad news. Yeah, he'll keep coming for us, so let's try to survive. Wait, where'd you go, Mikey? I'm way over here! We'll be fine as long as one of us is keeping watch. For now, let's just make a run for it. Let's go! This is dangerous. He's coming this way! I feel like he's getting closer. Let's run! We have to gather wood. He's following! Really? He is! You gather wood while I keep my eye on him. Yeah! Don't take your eyes off of him, okay? Don't let your guard down! He's seriously so scary! I'll try glancing away for a sec. Woo. Ah, he moved! JJ, here! Thanks, Mikey. I thought we had more distance between us, but he's right there! Can we even craft? Let's see. Oh! We're safe as long as we're facing him while we craft. JJ, I'm in trouble! I looked Shy Guy in the eye! What am I going to do? Are you serious? Yeah! This is bad. Looking at Shy Guy directly in the eye fills him with rage. He'll hunt anyone who dares to the end of the earth. He's a terrifying creature. Uh, I hate to say it, but you're doomed, Mikey. No! There must be something we can do! Oh, I've got an idea. We need to enhance our security before Shy Guy shows up looking for you. Cause he's searching for you as we speak, and he's set on hunting you down. Then, let's get started! Well, the first issue is, we don't know which direction he'll be attacking from. True. That's why I suggest we put our shelter on top of a long staircase. It'll act as a funnel. Good thinking! We'll set up our first security measure right here. What's it gonna be? I actually have something really cool in mind. First things first, we're gonna build a super long hallway. Yeah, that's it. Hmm, now check this out. Whoa! Awesome! Well, guess what? This is just the start. <laughs> now for the next part. This is our first line of defense. Uh, just this? You're right. An empty hallway won't stop Shy Guy, but a hallway full of lasers might. We'll make a laser minefield, but we gotta set it up so that the two of us can make it through. Okay, I get it! So we can jump over this one pretty easily, but keep in mind, Shy Guy is a lot taller than us. Mm. The best strategy is to put a bunch of lasers at his height. Oh, that makes sense! Check it out! We can walk underneath them no problem. 
but they're sure to hit Shy Guy right in the face. Ooh, that's clever. Those lasers pack a serious punch. Mm -hmm. If we scatter a whole bunch of them throughout the hallway, there's no way they'll be able to get through here, not without getting hit. So the more lasers, the better? Yeah, check this out. Ooh. These are sure to hit Shy Guy. <laughs> hit him right in the face. <laughs> nice. How's that looking? Hmm. Ooh. Not bad. I think it's great. <laughs> we definitely can't survive this. This one we jump over, and we're here. Now to add a vertical laser. Ooh, good thinking. I'll put this here. And that there. You get the idea. When the shy guy shows up, we'll bob and weave our way through while he gets lasered over and over. <laughs> a couple more. Why not? That should do it. Now, once we make it to the end of this hallway, we'll turn here and climb even more stairs. Awesome! That's a great idea! I'll just get things set up for the staircase. Alright, here's what I'm thinking, Mikey. This is where we're gonna set up our second anti-shy guy security measure. Another one, huh? Hmm. What's it gonna be? We've already got stairs and lasers. What security feature could we possibly add? I'd like to propose a narrow walkway over a pit of lava. I'll show you. Pit of lava? This seems strong. Okay. Ta-da! Lava! Woo! Oh, oops. It's overflowing. Wow! Look at this lake of lava! There. I fixed it. We now have our obstacle. But what do we need next? Uh... See this pipe? Yeah? I'm gonna lay it down all the way across. This is for security? Yep. I call this the tightrope walk. Oh! We'll need to keep our balance as we walk along the pipe and cross over the lake of lava. Oh, I get it! I'm making it harder by making the path super oh, windy. It is hard! Lose your balance and it's game over. You end up taking the hottest bath of your life. No kidding! Great plan, JJ! <laughs> Thanks! Now this is security. Whoa! Oops, my bad. Okay, I'll go this way. And this way. How's that? Looks good to me. Shy Guy's pretty fast on his feet. He sure is. And he's got stamina. True, but I think these twists and turns will really slow him down. Oh, yeah. I'll add a few more bends. Then as Shy Guy loses his balance, he'll slip off the pipe and fall into the lava. Hopefully. What a great plan! How could it fail? And... done! No way he can make it across! It's a tough path, but there's actually a trick to it. What is it? You and I can just jump over the gaps. See how simple it is to cross? Whoa, yeah! It's a shortcut! Yep. Amazing! So easy! For us. But I doubt Shy Guy will take a shortcut. True that! He'll probably try to cross here, ignoring the shortcut. He'll lose his balance, then fall into the lava. For sure! We'll be safe and sound while he takes an accidental dip. Alrighty then. I think it's time to make another staircase. A shelter! Oh, cool! Ready to get started? Let's do this! What kind though? I want something super safe! Hmm, let's see. So we have a bunch of lasers. Yeah. And the lava walkway. So there's only one reason we would need this place if the two security measures aren't enough to shake off the Shy Guy. Right! So it's a last resort kind of shelter. Exactly! There's no way he'll make it this far! Don't underestimate him! Shy Guy is no joke. He's incredibly strong. That's why we can't just build a place to hide. We also need this shelter to act as our third line of defense. You mean with a security system? What do you have in mind? I hope it's super duper secure. You'll see. We'll focus on our shelter first. We'll make the walls out of iron. You can give me a hand. This is very durable material. Great for shelters. True. As long as we don't leave any weak spots, it should be difficult for Shy Guy to break in. Yeah, these are sturdy. Iron walls are no joke. You said it. Next, for the entrance. A wooden door should do the trick. Yeah, a simple, flimsy, easily breakable wooden door. Wait. What? Hmm? Wooden doors aren't very secure at all! Yeah, that's true. Nice. I chose it on purpose. 
I want something weak, because this door is a trap. Really? Uh-huh. Walking through this door will activate a pitfall trap, causing the floor to collapse. No! Look at this. If Shy Guy were to fall from this height, he'd hit the ground and go splat. Yikes! Great idea, though. So this is the trap door. Right. Which means we need a secret entrance that's safe for us to use. Let's see here. Put these here. Woohoo! And then some of this. Fill this in. There. Now when we push this button, the door will open just long enough for us to get inside. That's perfect! Now, as for Shy Guy's entrance, we need to build the actual trap. What I'm thinking is, we make it out of TNT and sand. Okay, step one, placing the TNT. Alright, that looks good. Now to lay down a platform of sand. Then I'll place some redstone on top, and then another layer of sand, right at floor level. Now this part is extremely dangerous. Mikey, step back. Okay, got it! I'm laying down a stone pressure plate. Whoa! Now when Shy Guy shows up, he'll most likely break the door down. It's just a flimsy wooden one, so he won't have any trouble with it. The moment he steps on the pressure plate, the trap will activate and he'll go crashing back down to Earth. There's no way he'll survive that! Awesome! Chance. All that's left to do is wait. He could appear at any moment. True. Just be ready. Can do. The sun is setting, but there's still no signs of Shy Guy. Hmm, that's right. Since he's not here yet, let's take the time to properly prepare ourselves. Put some armor on. Great idea. Looking good. Now I'm really ready. With all the work we've done, I'm kind of hoping he shows up. Oh, he's definitely coming, so don't let your guard down. Sure thing. Hmm. Hmm. Hmm, where could he be? Still no sign of him. Duh. Ah! Mikey! Ah! He's here! JJ! JJ! He's chasing me! Yeah, he's locked onto you. Run as fast as you can. Quick, this way! I'm coming! That's it. Hurry, you okay? I'm scared! But I'm glad we have a security system! Me too! Oh, 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 hurry! Ow! I just got hit by our own laser! Shy Guy's getting hit too! Our system doesn't seem to be slowing him down one bit! He must have a ton of help! No way! Just keep running, Mikey! <laughs> this is not good! It sure is it! Ugh. I need to get my health back up. Come on, Mikey! <laughs> run, run, run! We made it through all our lasers. It's time for plan B. We have our lava walkway, so we're gonna be okay. Are you sure he can't cross this? How could he? We're the only ones who know the trick. <laughs> you can do this! <gasps> Come on, Mikey! We gotta go! What is it? Shy Guy's walking across like it's no big deal! What? Hurry up! I'm trying! Uh, Don't tell me he's right behind you! Uh, he's right behind you! Yeah, I said not to tell me that! <laughs> to the shelter of last resort! Quick! Sprint, Mikey! We have to hide! Uh, get in! Get in! <laughs> that was close! Too close! <sighs> yes! It looks like Shy Guy is trying to break through the wooden door! Don't stand on the sand, Mikey! I'll be fine! I don't think he's trying to get in! Whoa! What? <gasps> scared me! <sighs> Wait! Yes! We beat him? That's right! Amazing! We defeated Shy Guy! You looked Shy Guy in the eye, but you survived! Congrats! Thanks! Well done! Tonight! Keep your eyes peeled for the vicious Toon Cat. What? The Toon Cat is coming to town? Toon Cat? That's a super dangerous monster, right? 
Apparently, it chases its prey to the furthest reaches of the world. What do we do? Here's the plan, Mikey. We're gonna strengthen the security on this house to defend against the Toon Cat. We better get moving. We might not have much time. What do we do first? Let's see. Oh, I know. To start, let's make sure we've locked all the doors and windows. Then we'll set up these pressure plates. When the Toon Cat chases us, we'll run back to the house. Unfortunately, we need to open and shut doors manually. If we leave them open for too long, the Toon Cat will come in. But if I place the pressure plates here... What happens? The door will automatically close behind us once we're inside. Wow! That's going to be our first security measure. An automatic closing door. Oh, I see. We might have a problem if we place the pressure plates on the outside. See? Here's what I'm thinking. The Toon Cat can't open doors on its own, so this should help us. The door will force it out! Even though we can't get in the front door, we should expect the Toon Cat to eventually break inside. In that case, we need to add some more security. Like what? It might be a good idea to build a trap inside the house. Okay, what kind of trap? How about a cage trap? Good idea! Alright, what type of materials do we need? Let's use sticky pistons, iron bars, redstone torches, redstone dust, and repeaters for now. That should do it! Wow! This looks like a good spot. I'm digging a hole. Cool. How's that? Good job! Perfect! Next, I'm gonna set up a row of redstone torches. Hmm. Terrific! Moving on. Alright, what's next? Let me think. I dug another big hole so I have somewhere to put the repeaters down. Repeaters? Oh! Next up is the redstone dust. What's that for? Now I'll cover the top like this. Cool! I still need to install a lever. Whenever someone pulls it, the redstone torches will flicker on and off. That means it's working. Oh! Time for the pistons. Huh? They'll go up here. Oh. We can control all the pistons at the same time with just one lever. That's incredible! Yeah. How does it go? That's the easy part. Watch this. Wow! Let's see. Oh! You made complete! This is great! Yep. One more thing. We have to put a lid on it, otherwise the Toon Cat will be able to climb over. Why don't we try using glass? Sure. We can't have him climbing over it. Right. So this will work better. This will block him off, right? Yeah, probably.